Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for January 19th of 2023. Well, it is titled the Seagull Nebula. So what do we see here? Well, this is what is known as the Seagull Nebula for its perhaps bird like appearance, the nebula at the upper left being the head, and then kind of diagonally going from lower left to upper right, the wings of the bird as it would be perhaps flying through the air. Now this is actually a region of star formation and we see that a lot when we look at regions that have a lot of gas and dust within our galaxy and there are star forming regions including what we see as the seagull the seagull nebula here but even a part of it the upper part sometimes known as the parrot nebula for its distinct perhaps parrot like head and that is also known by a catalog designation of NGC 23 27. And within it, we can see a massive star recently formed uh, at the center of that and some dusty areas that are still denser dust material that may be in the process of collapsing to form other stars, kind of trailing away down toward the bottom from that bright star, and then the gas being illuminated and excited by the hot star that had formed. So the stars, the bright stars that form actually energize the material and cause it to glow. The gas will glow brightly and specific colors associated with the type of material that it is made up of. And for the most part, unless you're looking at specific regions, it's all going to be hydrogen gas, which makes up the vast majority of atoms in the universe. Now we also see a blue arc just a little bit below and to the right of center near a star. And that is an example of a runaway star known as FN Canis Majoris. A runaway star means that the star is traveling at a high velocity through space. And here we see a shock wave uh, ahead of it. That's the shock that blue arc is the shock wave as this star travels rapidly through dusty areas and gaseous areas and excites the material right in front of it as it moves through those. Now, how can a star run away? Well, there are various theories that can explain it, but perhaps one would be that it was once a companion star of a star that's exploded as a supernova. And with that star no longer present to keep up their orbits, it then was traveled rapidly through space and will continue doing so like that for the rest of its life. So that was our picture of the day for January 19th of 2023. It was titled the Seagull Nebula. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture. So until then, have a great day, everyone. And I will see you in class.